Episode 8 is called I Am Bane. Um, so I've got a lot of thoughts about this. What is up, Gothamites? Welcome back to a brand new Gotham video. And today, I don't know, I don't know what to think, really. Um, this is going to be kind of like a somewhat of a ranty video, but then I'm going to turn it around in terms of what I think Gotham might be doing. Because if you haven't been made aware already, over like the past day, some episode titles have been revealed for like the Flash show, um, and I went over those in yesterday's video, uh, but also Gotham as well. And if you remember, um, and I'll leave the card up there, um, I did a video on the first four episode titles of Gotham season five, and I did a breakdown of what I thought, you know, could be happening in the episode. But we also have now got the episode titles uh, four, episode five, six, um, and eight episode seven was kept secret and I think and I'll get to that in a little bit But the thing is um, the other day I made a video about the information that we got from I believe the hashtag show where they found out that we're probably getting Bane's father coming to Gotham uh, Eduardo uh, Dorrance, I believe uh, instead of you know Edmund yeah, which is in the comics and I thought okay I've always said Bane's not gonna work, you know in, in Gotham. It just wouldn't really work But when I heard of Eduardo, I was like, oh god, no, but and then I was like wait, no wait that 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 makes sense, you know, Bane could still be serving out, you know, his sentence uh, in prison and, you know, why not bring King Snake to Gotham? And, and then you could get like a cool reference to Bane in the pres in the prison called, you know, Pene Dura. I, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. I've never known. Pe it's not Pene, Pena, Pene, Pene. But everyone, episode eight is called I Am Bane. Um, so I've got a lot of thoughts about this a lot of thoughts um so before we get into this breakdown why not subscribe if you want to stay up to date with all gotham season 5 uh related news and everything like that uh, you'll never miss out on a video that way especially if you hit that bell button uh, but also if you do go on to enjoy this video i know you gothamites will smash that like button and thank you to those who did so before i really dive into this so episode 5 it looks like they're definitely doing bane like, they're, they're definitely doing something to do with Bane, eh? whether that's his father, and then they're introducing him, because episode 5 is called Penny Duro. Penny Duro, whatever you want to call it. Um, And that is the place where Bane is serving out his prison sentence, shall I say his father's. Um, but more interestingly, you know, a few episodes after that, you know, some more development, bloody blah, blah, blah. Uh, episode 8, right next to the finale, is called I and Bane, insinuating maybe that he's out of Penny Adura, uh, and, and that he's come to Gotham, and then it's like, oh my god, you know, I and Bane, and then, you know, they might lock him up, or something like that, all the conflict, blah, 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 story, 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 it's been resolved, and then, like, okay, we've got another Gotham villain, kind of like we've, how we've had Penguin, Riddler, and everything beforehand as well, and I don't want to seem hypocritical or contradicting to people being like, well, how can you accept the Riddler? How can you accept Penguin? As they're kind of, like, in their own villainy right now, as to what we know them in the comics, right? So why can't you why don't you like Bane really coming to the show early? And it's not that I don't like it. And I've always almost basically preached how, you know, you can change things up uh, from comic book to screen in an, in an adaptation. You know, it, it doesn't have to be copy and paste. But Bane is almost too far away, I think. You know, I, I've, I've never wanted to see a freaking Venom injecting Bane in a Gotham prequel show where Bruce... It's already being rushed to being Batman, understandably, because the show's ending. Um, but I didn't want to see a fully-fledged Bane on the show, uh, who, who, who can take Venom, become huge, and Bruce Wayne is goddamn barely 18 years old. It just, it's too far away from his origin story. Only in the sense of, like, how I said the other day, I was like, oh god, I, I, my first reaction to it was like, I'm not sure with Eduardo, you know, potentially Bane's father, but I was like, no, wait, actually, th this is okay, because it's like you're kind of bringing the Bane legacy kind of thing in the show in a way, uh, Bane would still be in Penny Oduro, uh, d serving out his sentence, and his father could come in the show, King Snake, and then, you know, uh, you know, kind of take it from there, and, and maybe that kind of just hints how Bane will be coming out of that prison eventually, and might come to Gotham to kill his father, or something like that. Kind of similar in how Bane met his father in the comic books, after the years and years and years of serving the King Snake's sentence. But another reason why I'm kind of concerned about this, and I'll get around to how I think, okay, like, I'm, I'm not gonna try and be an arsehole here, I'm gonna try and think about why are they doing this, they must think it could work, let's think about how this can work if they're doing literally I Am Bane, I'm sorry, like, titling something, episode 8, I Am Bane, that means you're, you're probably doing Bane, why, why call the episode I Am Bane if it's still all about his father and everything will kind of be okay, it, it's, it's gotta be about Bane. So the reason why this is kind of worrying to Gotham fans, kind of like myself, is that, you know, 
Season 5, we're getting 10 episodes, most likely 10 episodes, and it'll be coming next year in 2019, and we have already been teased with so much, so much stuff, um, and I'm going to really try and remember some things here, but don't forget about everything that is coming in this season, don't forget that in normal seasons, we get like over 20 episodes, I think it's around 22, um, you know, sometimes, you know, in other shows, like 23, 24, but I think Gotham's always been, yeah, 22, um, we're getting 10 episodes where they're turning Bruce Wayne into Batman. From a boy into a bat, essentially, right? Or a, a boy into a man. We're going full-on Batman here, and he hasn't even had much of a bat sequence yet, unless you count the Poison Ivy trip. Um, okay, that's going to be interesting to see how they do that. I know Bruce is going to realize that the GCPD can't take care of Gotham, so and he can't take care of it himself, so he needs to do it, like, you know, fr from a new perspective, like, or do it as the Batman. I, that's definitely what they're going to mainly go with. That's always what it's been about for Bruce, but I, th I feel like this would be more so it in the show. It's like, oh, I need to dress up and, you know, do something as a vigilante because they have already teased the gadgety kind of stuff uh, already and he might just think, oh, I'm going to apply the Bat Emblem. It's obviously going to be more complex than that. I'm not going to say it's not going to be. But then you've got all these villains like Ventriloquist, Scarface, uh, you know, you, you've got Freeze, you've got uh, Scarecrow, you've got, you've got so many villains that I'm already forgetting about. Um, <laughs> you've got mother you've got orphan and this isn't this isn't even to forget guys that we've had poison ivy teases this isn't even to forget that we've got the like the og team penguin riddler barbara tabitha it's just you've got all of these things to do and now gotham you're telling me something that i didn't even think would work in the first place that episode five is going to be titled penny dura as as well as um Episode 8, I Am Bane, right before you, you know, the show's ending, you're doing a fully-fledged, like, pretty hardcore Bane kind of arc. Now, you know, we heard the other day from the hashtag show that it looks like they're casting uh, Bane's father, because essentially, without going into that video too much, as I said, like, the card is somewhere up there, if you want to go check out that video and come back to this one. But Edmund Dorrance in the comics is Bane's father, right? He's also known as King Snake. And I thought, okay, that would make sense to bring him to Gotham. But now with I Am Bane, it, it, it may be the case that he's still in Gotham. And now uh, episode five, Bane might break out. That's Or it might still have something to do with Eduardo, uh, you know, Bane's father. Uh, and then episode eight, I Am Bane. It's going to be interesting. I'm not going to try and overreact here because I Am Bane could mean... Quite literally, the whole story maybe with Eduardo is happening and Bane uh, is in the prison and we might see like a, a situation where he's he realizes or like acknowledges to himself, I am Bane. Uh, it's all going to be set outside Gotham City at this point and then it will just be a tease for the future, right? I, but I just don't think that's going to happen. What I'm worried about is that in episode five, they might have Bane or somebody teasing or they might not really detail it too much. That Bane will escape Penny Adura. Uh, and then in episode 8, in the, you know, and, uh, in the in-between episodes, uh, they might have him develop a little bit. And in episode 8, they might have him kill Eduardo, his father. And he might be like, I am Bane. You know, I am Bane. He might generally do that. They might mix up his origin a little bit. They might have made him already uh, have been born in Penny Adura ages and ages ago. King Snake comes to Gotham. Uh, Bane escapes Penny Adura in episode 5 and blah, 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 blah. And I've kind of already mentioned this, but, you know, are they going to actually go outside Gotham City to Penny Adura? Like, you know, because that's in Santa Prisca and it's this whole different place. Um, so it's just going to be fascinating with all of this time and, and what well, not all of this time, 10 episodes where they've got all this shit to do. And, and I'm really trying to make you guys not forget about the, the grand scale of stuff they've got to accomplish, let alone turning Bruce into Batman. Uh, that's It's just crazy. And now they're going to do a Bane arc. I don't know. It's just, I, as I've said, I don't know. I can't say, oh crap, like Bobby, you know, Bobby, you're jumping the gun because you're, you're saying Bane's coming to Gotham and you don't know that. But I'm sorry. Episode eight being titled I Am Bane does insinuate to me that they're actually going to try and do a Bane origin. But like right in the last season, I think they, even though they might not be or they might be doing it subtly or something like that, that would be great. I'd be happy with that if it's not so force in our faces but if if i'm getting told or if this is actually happening that they're actually gonna do you know fully fleshed bane arc you know episode five penny oduro um episode eight i am bane um when you've got all this other stuff to focus on and i really feel like they should have you know probably have used that episode time just to focus on bruce wayne turning into batman and other things like that rather than do all of this as well i mean i admire the ambition i guess and at the end of the day as i've said i don't know how exactly this is going to go um, so I guess I'll have to wait and see, and I will tell you guys exactly what I think when it comes out. I'm just concerned that, um, you know, 
about how it might go down because as i said bane isn't you know meant to be in Go it would just be weird if he was in gotham right now so maybe maybe you know giving them the, the benefit of the doubt they might have something like i said the other day where eduardo you know his father actually is uh, in the city and I was quite happy with that I thought okay you know you can kind of have that connection to Bane and then they might tease something like in the Iron Bane episode that he escapes Penny Oduro or something like that and then that just kind of makes us think oh in the Gotham universe with David Mazus as Batman and everything like that we can kind of imagine and, and, and already see what Bane might be like and stuff like that even though we're not going to get any more that would be cool Gotham that'd be fine but don't shove him in our face when you're meant to be doing all of this other stuff. Uh, I just, I'm a bit concerned about it. The other episodes that we did get, you know, including Penny Odura, obviously I am Bane, uh, is the air is getting slippery. Uh, I really don't know what to say about that. And episode seven is to be announced. Um, and that's obviously, they didn't announce that one because it's too spoilery by the name, which is fascinating as to why they did the whole Bane one. They, they thought that wasn't spoilery enough. I guess it is, but it isn't. It's just like, Okay, uh, we could tell you that it might create a little bit of buzz, but episode seven is too important in terms of you could probably figure out some stuff. So I'm thinking maybe episode seven, I'm not going to say this is right, but it could be, you know, the moment where Bruce um, imagines and realizes that the bat is is the thing that needs to happen in Gotham City. It could be the moment where the bat goes through the window, whether he falls down a well like in the Dark Knight series or anything like that. It might be the bat defining moment and the episode might literally be called The Batman or like the, the beginning of the bat or something like that. Do you know what I mean? Where they thought, okay, we can't say what episode seven is called because everyone will know already and we don't kind of want that out so i don't know what else to say guys what do you think do you kind of agree with me if you know bane's true comic book origins you'll know what i'm kind of trying to say here and uh, be sure to check out why i don't think bane would work in gotham uh, my video on that it should be in the cards as well i go over why i don't think that him coming to gotham right now as bruce wayne is gonna be like a year zero zero year bat man uh, uh it just wouldn't make sense and now obviously this whole video has been based upon the stem of the fact that we might be getting him because episode 8 is literally called I Am Bane. So obviously and naturally I'm concerned about that where I don't think he should be introduced. However, bottom line, as I've said a couple of times, if they do the whole bringing his father in, uh, maybe his father like King Snake is causing a bit of trouble. I thought that was fair game. And then episode 5 is called Peña Duro. Uh, they, they kind of tease Bane there and then maybe Bane might start his ascent or like, you know, leave Penny Odura or something like that in episode 8 and they teased out there might be some justice or whatever for him serving out his sentence and killing his father. I don't know. But then as long as we don't see him and all venomed up and everything like that, I'll, I'll be okay. I can kind of push aside the fact that you're trying to put Bane in the, episode, in the season where you've only got 10 episodes and you're meant to be creating the Batman amongst a billion, trezillion other things. But anyway, guys, let me know your thoughts as always in the comments down below. This is something mega interesting to talk about, so I can't wait to read and respond to all of you. Well try and respond to all of you <laughs> other than that everyone uh be sure to subscribe to this channel if you want to stay up to date with more gotham videos just like this and of course like it if you did actually like the video because it really does help the video circulate ar around and helps promote on youtube of course follow me on social media if you don't already i know not everybody always expands the description box down below but please do so that way you can see my twitter link that way you can see my discord link and my instagram link and maybe even my patreon link do consider supporting me on patreon as it really does fuel the content i create on this channel but other than that everyone thank you so much for watching uh have another batarang imagine i just threw a batarang at you and i'll see you in the next gotham video but i'm worried about i and bane episode eight of season five